first, guys, we recently learned that Del Monte managed to take the average pineapple and turn it pink. Mm -hmm. Yes, pink, because that's better. Cody's here now with more on how they actually did it and a very special guest, the pineapple itself. I have the pineapple, ladies and gentlemen. We're very excited about the pineapple. We have Hans Suter joining us now from Del Monte to talk about this thing. What have you done, Hans? Have we gone too far with science? A pink pineapple man, are you nuts? <laughs> Are you mad? Good morning, Cody. Thank you for having me on your program. I'm Senior Vice President for Research and Development at Del Fresh Del Monte Produce, a global marketeer and producer of fresh fruit and vegetables, and really excited to share this new discovery from uh, our site. This is, I mean, this has been a thing in the works for a long time. How long did it finally get you guys, I mean, how long did it take to finally perfect this, this guy? We've been working on it uh, for the last 15 years. 15 it's years? It's been a long, yeah, it's been a long ride and uh, really excited to finally come to market with it. So this pineapple could be getting its learning permit right now to drive. That's how long, Hans. That's how long. Okay, so what makes it special besides just the color? Does it, does it taste different than a pineapple, a normal pineapple? Well, it's definitely delicious. I'm not going to spoil it, but it has some uh, notes of uh, uh, candy, pineapple, aromatics. Mm. And it's uh, very sweet, very juicy. You need to try it. Okay, so you guys, you guys were so kind to mail me one of these because I know they're in limited supply. There's not going to be a billion of these made, right? Um, but uh, we we thought about slicing it open, Hans. But we've got a better idea. My neighbor Bonnie is the best cook I know. So I'm going to give it to neighbor Bonnie, and she's going to make us a pink pineapple upside down cake. I love it. I love it. I feel like we've gone too far, Hans. You know what I'm saying? Like, you've gone too far and I've gone too far. We're making a monster here. So what I'm going to do is when Bonnie makes it, I'm going to take a picture of it and let you know our official, you know, view of this pineapple. But it smells unbelievable. Like, really yeah. aromatic. Yeah. Uh, everybody's so excited. Uh, we have received so many positive uh, comments from uh, consumers and it's really exciting to see how people are coming up with new uh, cocktails, new uh, desserts, new snacks. So it, it's uh, really bringing a new dynamics to this uh, sector. It, it, it is. It's really exciting. A brand new pineapple. It's, it's, I never thought I would live. To the, these days are amazing, Hans. Uh, Hans, uh, uh, these are a limited supply, right? They're not going to be, you know, forever. Uh, so what do you have to do to get one? Well, you can go to pinkglowpineapple.com and you'll find all the information you need to order uh, one of those. Okay. All right. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get neighbor Bonnie on it and we'll send you a picture and then we'll let you know what we think of it. All right. Excellent. Thank you so much. Thank you very much, Hans. How cool is that? The dude made a new pineapple, and it's pink. I don't know. What did we do? Nothing. We're going to make a cake out of it. Yeah, I know. We are going to make a cake out of it. Thanks, Hans. Back to you, John.